From a land so uncompromising, where failure often means death, comes a story of hope. This illiterate son of a peasant farmer would one day explode the myth that one of Africa's greatest problems can only be solved with help from outside. The odds were stacked against him. But against the received wisdom of the time and faced with daunting challenges, he has emerged as a pioneer in the fight against the encroaching desert. This is his incredible story. The story of Yakuba Sawadogo, the man who stopped the desert. There are many areas across our planet where deteriorating climatic conditions meet head-on with extreme poverty. None more so than this bleak belt of land between the Sahara Desert and the rich soils further south. It's known as the Sahel. It would seem that stories of doom and gloom are all that the outside world gets to hear of this place. Throughout the 1970s and early 80s, this region suffered relentless periods of drought and famine. As the desert conditions got ever closer, hunger forced more and more people to give up on their homeland and head for the cities. But away from the attention of the TV cameras, something happened that would transform the lives of thousands of people right across this region. This is Yakuba Sawadogo, the man at the heart of this story. These days he's a highly respected figure in his community. But it wasn't always this way. A quarter of a century ago, when he first started his battle to save the soil, no one imagined just how successful he would become. Yet thanks to his work, vast moonscapes of desert land have been transformed into fertile, life-giving soil. Crops have been planted. Forests have regrown. And the people have returned. Yakuba is really amazing in what he's doing because he never ever stopped uh, trying. He's, he's like a scientist and every year he's adding from his experience. Yakuba single-handedly has had more impact on soil water conservation in the Sahel than all the national and international researchers combined. But Yakuba's achievements have not been without opposition. We relive his fascinating journey. From the beginning, as a child struggling far from home, to his battle with the desert. As he dared to defy the authorities and accepted wisdoms. Right up to the present day, when his story takes on an incredible twist. Follow the peasant farmer from Africa as he takes his case to the heart of the Obama administration in Washington, D.C. Discover the untold story of the man who stopped the desert. <laughs>